good afternoon. Here are some random yet slightly challenging general knowledge questions. 20 in total. I will work my way through the 20 asking the questions, then take a very short pause and then work my way through the 20 answers. Number one, who designed the bouncing bomb? And used it was used by the famous dam busters to destroy the Ruhr dams in World War II. Number two, what is the name of the bell used in Lloyd's of London? Number three, in what year did Benito Mussolini invade Ethiopia? Number four, which group of people were emancipated in Britain in 1829. Number five. At one time, a member of Diagalev's company, she became director of the Royal Ballet. Who was she? Number six. He was the author of The Shortest Way with Dissenters and A Journal of the Plague Year. Who was he? Number seven, the Roman goddess of agriculture who bore a daughter by Jupiter is identified with the Greek goddess Demeter. What is her name? Number eight, what are the names of the two large towers of the Palace of Westminster? Number nine, who was the founder of the German Christian Democratic Party? Number 10, which open brackets, contemporary, close brackets, Composer first used the do decaphonic scale in his later works. Number 11. The yield of an oil well is measured in barrels. How many gallons are there in a barrel? As one who grew up solely metric, this has been a hell of a learning curve for me. Number 12. What special gift did Jean Baptiste Tavernier present to King Louis XIV of France? Number 13. Why do Tibetan priests search for a boy after the death of the Dalai Lama? Number 14. In what part of the world would you find a Gamelian orchestra? Number 15. His first play was The Room in 1957. And his other works include The Servant. What was his name? Number 16. What is natation? Number 17. What was the name of the rake in the rake's progress? Number 18. In the theatre, what would you be doing if you were papering the house? Number 19. Goethe wrote about him. Berlioz, Wagner and Liszt all composed music about him. Who was he? Number 20. What is the capital of Nepal? Okay. A short break.
while I get the answers. This is an old book, but I'm being careful to ask questions that are still valid. Okay. The man who designed the bouncing bombs, which were used by the dam busters, was Sir Barnes Wallace. He also designed the R-100 airship, the Wellington bomber, and the swing wing aircraft, which are still used today, for example, as the F-14 and the F-15. Lutine. The bell is known as the Lutine Bell in Lloyd's of London. The bell comes from HMS Lutine, a 32-gun frigate wrecked in 1799 off the Dutch coast. It was carrying money and bullion insured at Lloyd's. It hangs in the underwriting room at Lloyd's in London and is rung to draw attention to the announcement of news items. One stroke means that bad news will follow. Two strokes indicates the following news is good. Number three. Ein Moment bitte. Mussolini invaded Ethiopia in 1935. The people who were emancipated in Britain in 1829 were Catholics. Under the Catholic Emancipation Act of 1829, they were then allowed to sit in Parliament and hold any public office except Lord Chancellor, Lord Lieutenant of Ireland, or Prime Minister. That is still the law. Um, provided they took an oath denying the Pope's right to interfere in British affairs. So if they took the oath, they were allowed to take any office apart from those three offices. Obviously, Lord Lieutenant of Ireland is now defunct, um, but Lord Chancellor and um, Prime Minister still exist. The first and only Catholic Prime Minister of the, of the United Kingdom since the establishment of the Church of England, of course, was Boris Johnson, who was a late convert. Um, Tony Blair was not a Catholic while he was in office. After his period, after he left government, uh, quite some time after he left government, he converted to Catholicism. So, interesting little bit of religious and political history. Um, the Agalev Company, a member of whom later became director of the Royal Ballet, it was Dame Nanette de Valois. The author of The Shortest Way with Dissenters and the Journal of a Plague Year was, of course, the legendary Daniel Defoe. He was an English novelist and political pamphleteer. I suppose the modern equivalent would be influencer. Um, 1660 to 1731, he was born in London. He was also the author of Robinson Crusoe, Maul Flanders, and so forth. Ah, yes. Roman goddess of agriculture, who bore a daughter by Jupiter, is identified with the Greek goddess Demeter. She is, of course, Ceres, and from that comes agriculture and crops that are grown, and of course, cereals. Ah, the name of the two large towers of the Palace of Westminster are Clock Tower and Victoria Tower. Southwestern Victoria, or Central Tower, is 336 feet high. The Clock Tower, or St. Stephen's Tower, is 329 feet high and contains 
the clock famous for its 13 and a half ton bell. The bell is, of course, called Big Ben, not the tower, not the clock. The Christian Democratic Party in Germany was founded by Dr. Konrad Adenauer. He lived between 1876 and 1967. He was founder and chairman of the Christian Democratic Party, brackets or union, close brackets, 1946 to 1956, and Chancellor of the West German Federal Republic. Which contemporary composer first used the Doa Decaphonic scale? That would have been Arnold Schoenberg, who lived between 1874 and 1951. The system is illustrated in Schoenberg's Suite for Piano, Opus 25, 1923, and was adopted by his pupils Alan Berg and Anton Webern. The yield of an oil well is measured in barrels. How many gallons in a barrel? 35 imperial gallons or 42 US gallons. It's always worth remembering that there is US Imperial uh, system, separate system to Imperial, mm, as I discovered from my drinking days in New York. The gift that was given by Jean-Baptiste Tavernier to King Louis XIV of France was a diamond, specifically the Hope Diamond, which at 44.4 carats is one of the largest known diamonds, was probably part of a 112 and a half carat stone found in the Kilmoor mine, Golconda, India. Why do Tibetan priests search for a boy after the death of Dalai Lama? because they believe the Dalai Lama is reincarnated in this manner. In what part of the world would you find a Gamelian orchestra? Southeast Asia, most specifically Indonesia, uh, the Indonesian and Siamese orchestra. A full Gamelian orchestra is a powerful producer of rich and varied tones and depends largely on percussion for its effects using instruments of the marimba, xylophone, and gong type. His first play was The Room in 1957, and his other works include The Servant. His name was Harold Pinter. What is natation? Natation is swimming. It comes from the Latin Natar, natantem natare, to swim. What was the name of the rake in the rake's progress? His name was Tom Rakewell. The rake occurs in the well-known series of pictures by Hogarth. Stravinsky's last opera, The Rake's Progress, was based on those pictures. Papering the house is filling the theatre or house with invited guests on complimentary tickets. Ah, Goethe wrote about him. Berlioz, Wagner and Liszt all composed musical about him. Who was he? Faust or Dr. Faustus? Of course, the capital of Nepal is Kathmandu. Thank you very much. I hope you enjoyed these rather challenging questions.